firewalk with me? Welcome to Peppers and Glowworms, a channel dedicated to hot chili peppers and coldly glowing glowworms. <coughs> Hello there. It is uh, peak glowworm season in the local area where I am and I wanted to check out a site where I hadn't previously checked for fireflies and glowworms uh, and I figured why not record a little chili taste test on the way there. So I'm having a little uh, afternoon early night walk to get to this site and this is the Ahi Charipa F2 specimen 6, a berry that just dropped off by itself when I, when I um, did a little pollination shake. It just dropped and I figured I should probably eat it now before it turns old and leathery. Yeah, I have prepared, I have eaten my oats, I drank my milk, I have some heat remedies in my bag and I was going to record this with my real camera but um, it's already getting dark and so I have to rely on the light on my phone and I'm recording this on my phone but I have the pushel technology so audio should be all right ah, okay enough with the ramblings Let's do this. Oh, I haven't even <laughs> bitten down and I can feel the strong taste and heat coming from the little hole that the stem ruptured. This should be interesting, I guess. <sighs> All right. Here we go. Okay, not as bad as I was <laughs> expecting the heat to be far less than my little surprise <clears throat> the specimen 2B I guess was it that just uh, surprised me with a load of heat. This one has some heat, some considerable heat, but not too much. Not very much. Okay, um, the taste is, uh, well, I'd, I'd say like a habanero, like a habanero, but um, without this soapy peachy uh, note. So it's all right. Uh, I guess I would say taste is a six or seven out of 10. So let's say it's, mm, I'm feeling generous today, I'd say a 7. And the heat, hmm, it's 
more than than average and more of a slow burn it's uh, not dying down no it's um, more like firing up a little bit so i'd say yeah seven seven two so specimen six seven seven heat seven taste seven overall not bad oh and this one this one immediately hurts in my tummy specimen 2b was a real burner sudden burn but um, i didn't feel it at all in my stomach that's weird if that's a function of the capsaicin and capsaicinoid uh, composition then i'd say for my personal uh, preferences specimen 2b is superior quick and strong burn in the mouth and no burn at all in the digestive tract and this one mm, no a little burn or not too big burn in the mouth but oh i don't like it in the stomach but i guess it's all right it's not too much okay well, I guess I have to walk a little bit more and I should probably turn down the bad artificial light. Light pollution, you pick. It's going out now. Okay, so far, no littering. Um, that's it so far. If I find some interesting bioluminescent activity on my walk, I will probably add this to the video, but if not, Huh? <laughs>